mercy! I did nothing to you! You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. This is about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorinobu Arasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. I'm thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. 
I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness he getting corporal agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? Hmm. <sighs> Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think... They'll trust the word of a merc. I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain. Procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are uh, its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist. Thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some.
Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there. Rogue. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo Sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. Dolma is choosy, expensive, and rude. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she would not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Yorinobu Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka is still a despotic machine and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make it like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dickwipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back. Looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead, or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? What'd I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Can we meet? 
Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Hey, look. before got a good memory for faces bars closed sorry Chief. need to talk to punch and judy she in her den yep take the stairs down i'll let judy know you're coming just don't let me catch you messing around okay Concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Sus, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say. Susie seems to know what she wants. She your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? I need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Doombas killed like a real pro. Caught some lead myself, too. Boo hoo. Occupational hazard. What's with you? Quit lagging behind. Sure, I took a risk. We all did. But it was Evelyn who gave it to us in the first place. She knew what this was from the start. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. Writing's on your face. Excuse me? I came here with a simple question. You're the one making me desperate if I am. Maybe instead of judging, you could just tell me where she is. All right, enough. Get lost. You care so much. Find clouds. Look there. And where's clouds? Sig case on my desk at the address. Just take it and go.
Mega Tower. Luxurious. What's clouds? A dollhouse. But can't say I like your chances if you don't know that much. Read the streets. Evelyn's there. You know this. Or are you guessing? Saw it in the tarot. Now ghosts before I call the girls. Hold on, a dollhouse? Evelyn a regular there? Or a drone? you have somewhere to be? Where do you give the working girls a helping hand? That's ancient history. And like all history, it was pretty damn bloody. What was it? Something about a riot. Joy girl murdered by a tiger claw? Not the first. Just the one that tipped the scales. Folk went ballistic. Streets overflowed with raised fists. Girls, pimps, outcasts, the whole freak show. It's how the mocks got started. But that's old news. We're running a business now, not a charity. Can't help everyone in this city. Gotta take care of our own. Moxes come first. and the club brings in a lot of biz. Pisses its share of cost, too. Why, looking to invest? Nah, I'm just admiring your operation. We took over this place way back when. Every day I wake up and wonder how it's still standing. We get by, that's all I'll say. You know what happened to Evelyn Parker? Why are you asking me? You talked to Judy about her already. Sure, but you're the boss. You might know something more. Evelyn jumped the Mox ship a long time ago. And anyone not a Mox is not my damn problem. Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. She cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. They call me Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No, pleased to meet you? Hmm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Hey, look.
look. like we found the last honest cop in this city. Her name's Anna Hamill, and whatever she's investigating, it's made her a lot of enemies. She'd do best to cut it out if you catch my drift. Uh, okay, look, I know how it sounds, but somebody would have taken this gig anyway, right? I don't know. Maybe there's an angle you can play here. Either way, info's attached. T-Bug's death. What did you hear? The truth. She got burned. Like anyone who tries to hit Arasaka. They found the body in her pad. Nervous system fried. You know what that feels like? Hmm. Can't say I do. They say it's like a hundred thousand knives stabbing you at once. I can't imagine a worse way to go. Poor girl. I liked her, too. How's this work? Any punk off the street can waltz in here? Grab some shady running soft? No, not just any punk. Over the counter, we fix cyber decks. But if you come recommended and you know what you are looking for, I'm sure you will find it. T-Bug sent me. Said you'd have something for me. So you are V. I'm sure you heard what happened. Real shame. She left a demon for you. A gift from beyond the grave. It should work on any third gen deck. Got a Militech power line. Think it'll do. Mm. Solid gear. For a beginner. Okay. Glad to grab a demon, always. You could test it now. I have an access point. If you'd like, that is. You might extract some shimsoft or subroutines. Seems worth a try, either way. Got anything Nova for sale? If you can afford it, yes.
This time. Good, you ran a discount yesterday. Half price on everything. Haven't said anything. Way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off. 
or getting off. Place your bets. HQ disaster is fast approaching. In 2023, Night City was shaken to the If I miss this time, enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. later succumbed to acute radiation sickness. This tragic incident... Arasaka and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corpse leave it to the gang. Suits collars and gets soiled. Surprised? Sewer system will no be addressed one. as fumigation of the tunnels begins tomorrow. Due to the use of well, hold on. You take a blow up doll, cream all the and that's cheap. That's infidelity. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? Looking for Evelyn Parker. Does she work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I'm not a customer. Well, all the more reason to be excited. There's a first time for everyone at Clouds. It's no reason to dawdle. All you need to do is jack in. We'll create your personal profile and you'll be good to go. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting. Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. You never get what you expect. Consider my interest peaked. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Samurai. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky rather go with sky i couldn't have chosen better myself now for the payment and you'll venture into the clouds There you go. And 
the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Clouds is Go one eat of the dick, Johnny. places in all of Night City. We hope you enjoy your stay. if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. Hi, I'm Sky, and you must be Vincent. V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay then. V. Welp, looks like this'll be interesting. So, V. You're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside. You fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. I was told this place to fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting, this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already. That's tough. Rather let it eat away at me a bit more. Fear of death is what drives us all to do what we do. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? People I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. 
or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction, the end. But as a change, that thought alone could save your life. might just be afraid. So I imagined these things to distract myself from the thought of the void. Because that's about what greeted me before. Fear is your most effective weapon in the fight against death. So what now? Now. You find out. Which is... you're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should've. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you need. How do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you got a kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh... For all this. Jeez. Don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its end. Samurai. going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. I need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? A lot of things been going on in my head lately. This was... different. Refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here. Come back. But I need something else. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. Answer the question. Do it. And then you can get back to whatever it is you do. Here's what I don't do. Spill to any rando who walks in here. How about those good looks of yours? Be a shame if they dip below club standards. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where'll I find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Every 
motherfucking week! You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am! No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog! I'm taking it up with you, here, now! You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This gonk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there! From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. Oh. No shortage of wise asses. I'll say. You're going back upstairs? In a minute. Need to piss first. Thing, whatever stands to fuck me up. You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much, even for me. Hi. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure. Uh. Don't have your details? 
Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. I need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Try calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Okay, Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Motor Told me she left, like I said. A washing machine has a motor. Uh, can we? Where can I find this Woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back office. Except it's off limits to customers. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. <laughs> the skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. <laughs> Got some new hardware. <laughs> Motorcycle, not motor. Oh, what? Hey.
left her purse. Could have had more than one. All the shit's in it, though. Must have left in a hurry. Clients allowed in here. Be a room and close the door on your way out, would you? As you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. You look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on. I'm listening. You've got info, I've got eddies. It's a fair trade. What's your price? You need to pull your head out of your ass. Eddies will buy you whores here, not snitches. I look like either of those to you. How to look the menu here and know. You don't look a thing like these meat puppets. More like a Joy Boy's cum rag. You... insolent fuck! you can't talk to dead people. Oh, wait. You're doing it now. Anyway, just scour his comp. That just might work.
Ready or not, here I come. <laughs> Sold her off to a ripper. Chip was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toys Where wet dream.
required to return your weapons. Even though I'd rather not. Hey, I don't know anything. I just work here. Nice work back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? That's it for them. Uh, no. No. Don't have time to massage egos. I respect that. <laughs> of course you do. You'd have loved to have dropped the H bomb in this place. No need to go so OTT. I've got other methods. Right. No One thing's for sure, though. Claus won't forget this. I think Fingers got her. I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. in any condition to find help. Oh, fuck! What the hell's that? No, no, damn it! Jesus, the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommish before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half-century-old score neat settling, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. Feel Listen, I know actually. things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so... This Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. I still don't see how Mikoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are ya? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Mikoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Bet it still is today. Telling ya, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, 
me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bombs named Alt Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet. But you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside Makoshi. <laughs> 